Oh, okay. How's your face doing? Mm, it's okay. Not great still. <laughs> it looks like it's got you. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I look like all wrinkly and it's like really dry and not very pleasant. Oh, geez. Sorry about that. Have you tried yeah. anything else or? Tried a lot of things. <clears throat> but I got a doctor's appointment soon, so I'm going to check it out. Okay. Uh, he's not coming today. He wants to reschedule for tomorrow. He said um, it wasn't in his book. We, we, and he's in the city right now. So we, we got to reschedule that. So no chat. But I, I did talk to the guy yesterday, and it was a really good chat. He wasn't a programmer. He's more of a product manager. But he actually, he actually get this. He's creating conscious communities like a uh, a place for conscious communities called planets remember i said that using the game we could every planet could be a shared knowledge community oh yeah anyway it, just, huh. it seemed a little bit of synchronicity uh and also product manager i mean that could be someone to help you bring all the cards and everything into focus well, actually, Gino, Gino says he's getting a, t a team together of, of people to get the cards out. He's uh, okay. really stepping up the plate, specifically more around the cards. Uh, but he, he, he had sent us um, three people, right? So we've got tomorrow. Um, are you, let me see, on Tuesday at 2 o'clock and 3 o'clock. Are you, can you set aside time? Tuesday, your Tuesday? Yeah, Tuesday, my time, 2 o'clock p.m. and PST. Uh, yeah. So we've got mm. Narek, who's who the person I just talked to. And we, you know, it was the alignment was so good that, you know, second meeting taking place. And so that will show the chat. I mean, he essentially, he's already got. Um, and he's an app, I mean, he's, he's an app developer, has been an app developer, so he does know about that. Um, and he does have a team in Armenia, and he's got, again, he's got his own conscious uh, sort of connection. It, it just fits, like the divination would fit in there, and the, I think the, the, the chat room would fit in there, like just actually to put that stuff within his program. So oh, yeah. we're going to look at that two o'clock on Tuesday. And then the other guy, three o'clock is, I'm not sure. I think he's more of a programmer, but I think the guy today is more of a programmer. So. Okay. So, um, so you're, you got time Tuesday, two and three o'clock. Three o'clock and four o'clock is better than me, but have you already booked them or? Um, it's better for you at three and four o'clock. Yeah, I mean, closer to five is better for me, but... Well, no, I think that was the earliest for him because he's somewhere else and that was getting really late for him. Ah, okay. I think he's kind of on the other side of the planet or something, so two o'clock was kind of like the the best. Okay. So you can still make that? Yep. Okay. Okay. Yeah, remind me tomorrow or, or confirm tomorrow with me, but yep. Okay. Okay. And then tomorrow, what time tomorrow? What time tomorrow? Is there a time tomorrow for Josh? Uh, so we're supposed to meet today. Um, oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, five o'clock is good if that works for him again or okay. could work again. Let's try again tomorrow at five. Yeah. Okay. Hey, and so why couldn't you uh, message me Sunday saying, you said you didn't have time to message me? I messaged you to tell you I didn't have time to message you? <laughs> well, no, uh, I was trying to set this up yesterday, right? And uh, I was just waiting and and you didn't contact me all day. And you said you didn't have time to message me. Oh yeah, I ran out the door right in the early morning. And I just had to go. <laughs> okay. Did you know I was contacting you then, or you didn't know? No, no, that's what I mean. I didn't even look. I didn't even open my computer. Okay, okay. I, I yeah. thought for some reason you knew, but I guess you didn't. No, I didn't see it until I got home. 
Okay. Okay. So, so how's how's the war going in uh, in the game of planets? What's what's going? Uh, I got. Uh, I'm, I built seventy five battleships. Seventy five. Yeah, they're all. I'm just building more and more battleships every day, and just sticking them together in a fleet. So, are, do you think battleships are, are better than aircraft carriers? Uh, well, I mean, I don't know. Carriers like, are pretty good too. Like you got reports, right? When you were in battle, like you got a pretty extensive report, right? Hmm. So, and is destroyers there just to sort of like, let's say you've got ten battleships, ten destroyers, ten carriers. The destroyers are kind of there just to to be cannon fodder, right? But they take the the firing power away, kind of thing. Well, I mean, in real life, we're still using destroyers and everything too. Right. No, I'm just wondering about the the best combination of ships in terms of. I don't know. You don't know. No, nah, I don't know. It depends. Did, I don't did know. You, didn't you get reports saying sort of like what happened? Like, how do you do the algorithm of who fires first and what fires on who and that's all a, a big computer algorithm, right? Yeah. So you don't remember how you did it? No, I know how I did it. It's just, I, I can't tell you, you know, because I, I don't know, like, what's the best combination of ships or anything. No. Best weapons, best shields are important. Because, I mean, the flux cannons, they, they do double damage to the shields, right? Yeah. So that must be important. Like, I've got some ships that are just flux cannon battleships. Hmm um and then but the missile ships and then i've got some battleships that are just missile battleships i'm just wondering combos in terms of i don't know so you got 75 battleships yeah so he hasn't attacked you in a while uh he's attacked me a few times but i'm just building up because i want to have a good force yeah and i got some jump gates now so that's good uh, so i i'm gonna have five jump gates within a couple nice. days. So then, um, and the conscious, co conscious Collective is in the battle now because they're being attacked. He said they attacked his home world, but he got thrashed. They attacked with a bunch of ships, but I guess his home world was pretty well defended. So he, he uh, it didn't go so well for him. Hmm. So he must have probably lost a lot of his Navy doing that. I don't know. I mean, he, he was sending a science vessel through my territory. And I said, why are you doing that? Sounds like a spy ship. And he just, he changed the direction, so I, I think he's a little worried because uh, yeah. I imagine if we all formed a coalition. Um, That's what I've been saying. <laughs> well, I'm just I'm, I've just been building my own forces. Now I've got my uh, my engine going, so now I got my resources going. So I'm doing the same thing. I'm building tons of ships. So um, I'll, I'll enter the fray at, at some point. I just yeah. I didn't want to enter the fray with nothing, but with the jump gates now I can organize my whole fleet in one. You know, I, I can focus my entire fleet from five different positions, right? Plus, if you're allied with someone, you can actually use their jump gates, too. Okay. So, he, you know, we can all jump into the same system and do a big attack. Okay. So, <laughs> and Conscious Collective, they said they had a, they have jump gates. So, yeah. may, maybe it's time to have a, a, a battle to end all battles. But I just wonder, like, how hard is it to knock out the planets? Like how good are smart mm -hmm. minds? Mm -hmm. And why did you put only yeah. the hundred on orbitals and smart minds? Yeah, I'm probably going to change that. You know, you can yeah. if you if I click, let's say I click two hundred minds. I have some planets with two hundred minds because when Me you too. first yeah. when you first do it, you pop them together. It doesn't stop you. Yeah, I noticed that too. So <laughs> I'm probably going to get rid of the limit anyway. Because uh, then, yeah, you get a thousand miles. I mean, I think you should be able to put so many in the planet that they, you just wouldn't even touch them, right? Hmm. I mean, we're going to get so strong at some point that, and I shield like, but again, like the planetary shield, I still don't like that ten percent thing. Mm, oh no, it's changed. I changed the twenty percent already. Twenty. It should be like sixty percent. No, no, twenty per level. Oh, twenty per level. Yeah. No, but that's for the small shields, not for the big shield. The big shields are oh, there's no, only the one gravity shields. The gravity shields are ten percent. Yeah, but the big shields are seventy percent. You just don't have them yet. Remember? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay the, yeah, the planetary shield is the one you want. Okay. 
Well, I have a planetary shield, but you're saying it's only 10%. Like the, the you got the and you got the gravity shield. Right. Right. But there's also the planetary shield. Oh, okay. You okay. get it from large scale shielding that's at the end of uh engineering. Okay. Yeah. That one is okay. 70%. Okay. So any progress on the back end or none at all, I guess. No, not at all right now. I have to finish my so a bunch of other crap. Okay. So it looks like yeah. until until we find someone else, it looks like we won't be able to help Liz CL out, eh? Is that? Uh, not in the next few days, but I hope too soon. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I still want to get to it as soon as possible. I'm just I'm just swamped with a lot of stuff right now. Okay. Okay, and uh, maybe one of these guys on Tuesday can help. I guess we'll yeah. see. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Anything else you want to talk about, or I should let you go, probably. Um. Yeah. No. Well, not at this time. Okay. I hope you get something for your eyes. It just it, it sure does. It makes you look as if it's really bugging you. Yeah. It is. It's. Yeah. It's frustrating. Yeah. Feels terrible. Oh. This I'm is afraid. after I steamed my face this morning. I wake up and my skin is all really dry and ugly. And just hurts a lot. Oh, damn. Sorry about that, man. That must make everything just horrible. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Like, yeah. Every morning I wake up and it's horrible. <laughs> huh. Oh. Yeah. So I don't know. Hopefully I'll get it fixed today. Or not today, but this week, hopefully. Okay. Sure, some antibiotics or something. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. So I'll I'll talk to Josh, see if I can do tomorrow at five. If not, I'll try to do it maybe on Tuesday after the other ones or something. Okay. Okay. Yeah, just let me know what you got. Okay. All right. Take it easy, my friend. All right.